City Transformer A huge demand for micro cars these days is not accidental. In urban conditions, such a car ensures a comfortable drive in heavy traffic or in confined spaces. Startup City Transformer intends to bring the concept of compact cars to a radically different level. When creating the vehicle, several innovative solutions were applied at once. The main feature of the electric car is the Transformer chassis, which allows passing extremely narrow places while driving. The wheelbase tapers to the width of the body, allowing it to squeeze into narrow spaces. As soon as the vehicle exits into open terrain, the chassis expands, adding stability to the electric car on the road. Another feature of the City Transformer is a modular cabin. The manufacturer plans to produce several body modifications, adapting to the customer's requirements. Highlights of the car include an autonomous driving system, a heads-up display, and an energy-absorbing chassis design that increases the safety of the mini car. Ghost Pacer Ever dreamed of getting a running buddy that fits your schedule? Developers of the Ghost Pacer believe they have found a solution to this problem. They created augmented reality running glasses, projecting a virtual running companion. Basically, you have to compete with an avatar. The device has relatively little processing power, but it is quite enough to create a virtual display with a resolution of 1280 by 720 pixels. The viewing angle is 30 degrees. The digital rival runs next to you, and the main feature is that the glasses remember different routes and are able to exchange user data. Thus, you can upload the results of friends or your own achievements, and create a virtual avatar that will exactly repeat those runs. Due to its relative simplicity, the device weighs just over 0.2 pounds, while one battery charge is good for 6 hours. Following Fan Every summer, we face record freezing temperatures, dreaming of finding shade and chill. Creators of the following fan project are confident that they will make life easier with a modified fan that can monitor surroundings. It automatically reacts to the appearing person by keeping the airflow in their direction. The fan will follow you in any direction for a directional effect. It may seem strange, but even such a simple device nowadays has computer vision. Its algorithm works on a microprocessor and a camera built into the body. By analyzing the data flow, a device determines the location of people and immediately turns to them. As with conventional fans, there are three speeds and a pendulum mode available. Finger Track Virtual reality is constantly improving in terms of graphics. However, it still has difficulties with contactless control interfaces. Cornell University and Wisconsin-Madison University staff unveiled an innovative VR controller designed to revolutionize virtual reality. The device called FingerTrack is a wristband with four built-in thermal imaging cameras. They track hand movements with amazing accuracy. The data is transferred to the Raspberry Pi single board computer, after which the digitized information is sent to the workstation. The software performs in-depth analysis and predicts one of 20 finger joint positions. This happens instantly and the accuracy of the system far exceeds the capabilities of existing controllers. Even the smallest finger movements are tracked by finger track. The gadget sees when a person clenches his or her fist, writes, opens a notebook, or takes a mug in his or her hand. The technology will allow both achieving full immersion in computer games and being used for remote control of robots during demining bombs, research in hostile environments, and even work on space stations. Apex Watercraft Tier from luxury yachts, we're instantly transported to innovative designs like the Apex Watercraft Tier sit-down kayak. This type of water vehicle is a traditional fishing boat of the peoples of the Arctic. However, in our time, the kayak has gained more recognition as an excellent vessel for sports tourism. Rafting on rough rivers attracts attention of hundreds of thousands of extreme sports fans. The creators of Apex Watercraft Tier aim to bring kayaks back to their origins, giving them new possibilities. To this end, engineers have developed a lightweight body that has a simplified drainage system and a smooth bottom. The kayak is made of polymer foam lined with carbon. Thanks to this design, it has increased stability and easily moves in shallow water. In addition, the tier has a swivel chair which significantly increases its comfort and boosts possibilities in terms of fishing. Zarema Sleep problems are often associated with inappropriate posture during rest. 
Creators of the Zarima project offer a fresh look at the situation and a smart relaxing. For this, they have created a smart pillow that has many useful features. In addition to an anatomically correct shape, the device constantly analyzes the person's posture and monitors whether his or her head is in the correct position. The pillow automatically adjusts to your body, eliminating snoring and neck numbness. Using the mobile app, you can see the details of the night's rest. The gadget detects different phases of sleep, records any activity and even provides a smooth awakening. If during rest, the pillow hears a person snoring, it aligns the position of the head so that the airways are not blocked, saving you from an unpleasant nighttime phenomenon. Zarima is charged with a regular USB cable. Sanitronics Hygiene and cleanliness issues will always be essential, especially when it comes to public toilets and the labor involved in cleaning them. Sanitronics International has a long history of developing automated washrooms. More recently, they introduced a modular system, a self-cleaning public toilet that should become part of the smart city concept. Imagine a restroom that, after being used, launches a whole swarm of different devices, putting the room in perfect order in the shortest possible time. After being used, the toilet bowl automatically slides off and a clean fixture takes its place. Meanwhile, the dirty structure is covered with a container where a complete cleaning is done. At the same time, built-in sinks clean up the floor covering. As a result, the next visitor ends up in a clean and perfectly tidy washroom. Each element of the room is fully automated. Besides, energy and water consumption is minimized while waste is thoroughly filtered. Special attention can be paid to the appearance of the restroom. The developers intend to integrate public toilets into the city's infrastructure in such a way that they fit harmoniously into the surroundings. Fathom Hypersub For last, we kept a truly amazing project by the American company Marion Hypersub. This development is called Fathom and features a high-speed submersible boat. On water, the vessel practically hovers above the surface, while its draft is below 24 inches. However, as soon as the hatch closes and the boat picks up ballast, it turns into a submarine. The Fathom's design allows staying afloat even when upside down, and the split ballast system provides positive buoyancy at a 12-ton load. The boat's cruising range is 1,000 miles without refueling. Maximum surface speed is 45 knots. After submersion, this figure equals to 3.7 knots. The boat was mainly developed as a military project for intelligence and special operations. The maximum diving depth is 1,197 feet. Ono Bicycle Van Not all mini cars are actually cars. Sometimes engineers step into related directions and present very unusual projects to the world. This is how the Ono Pedal Assisted Transporter was born, popularly nicknamed the Van Bike. It is difficult to compare this transport with something, since the usual bikes are not competitors to it and it does not reach the courier trucks. The main purpose of Ono is the delivery of goods in busy city streets. The cargo bike has two electric motors with a total power of 250 watts and has a speed of up to 15 miles an hour. In fact, they simplify pedaling for the driver. The van can also move independently but only at speeds up to 3 miles an hour. Ono has a built-in loading ramp and a body with a volume of more than 2,000 liters. The carrying capacity of the vehicle is 661 pounds, including the trailer. Lua Smart Planter How many times did you imagine your home plants being alive and having emotions? One of the fresh startups offers to bring such an unusual idea to life by creating innovative flower pots for this. When the device is activated, the application on the smartphone will ask you to indicate the plant to be planted. The device then loads the appropriate profile and the green corner immediately comes to life. A virtual face of your plant appears on the display, which interacts with the environment and reacts emotionally to various events. For example, a pot grimaces when a flower lacks water or vice versa, it suffers from excessively wet soil. In case of a lack of sun, the virtual assistant turns into a vampire, while when it's cold, it freezes with you. It even reacts to your arrival by tracking any movements near the pot. Technical College Kosen Bottle Robots 
Japan's Kosen Technical College Network is well known for its five-year education courses for future engineers. At the annual Kosen RoboCon event, students present the most interesting robotics projects. At one of those events, Japanese talents showed a series of unusual drones called Bottle Robots. Their main goal is to perfectly execute a popular bottle tossing challenge. As we can see, they achieve their goals with amazing accuracy. Behind a rather ridiculous at first glance task lies a serious scientific approach. It includes project development, building a working structure from scratch, and creating custom software. You can see that bottle robots move around a specially drawn field, orienting themselves in space using cameras and sensors. The drone calculates the strength and direction of the toss with an accuracy of a couple of inches. Students competed with each other on several tasks, including setting of a maximum number of bottles on a small area. Many parts of the experimental robots were produced using 3D printing. A software integration, as well as its developments, were carried out by the students themselves. IEVX German engineers have always been able to surprise. An electric minicar IEVX is another proof to that. The car is five times smaller than a modern sedan, and its dimensions are 30 by 63 inches. However, small dimensions are not at all the main feature of the presented transport. An electric car has got a sliding base that turns a single minicar into a two-seater futuristic electric carriage. The length of the transport increases to 75 inches, and if you want to additionally place any load into the car, you can increase this figure to 87 inches. However, stable ride in this mode is doubtful. The electric car is literally stuffed with modern technologies. The body is made of carbon steel and aluminum. It has got retractable side mirrors, smart instrument panel, and solar panels on the car roof. The power reserve in the maximum version is 75 miles. Mazu 82 Yacht Turkish shipbuilders believe that a unique yacht should feature a combination of modern materials, luxury minimalism in terms of style and ultimate safety. And it's hard to disagree with them looking at the motor yacht Mazu 82. The hull of the vessel is completely made of carbon fiber, which has achieved outstanding strength characteristics and tangible weight reduction. The highlight of this yacht is the bulletproof glass, tempered and reinforced with a special film. The windshield is 0.87 inch thick. The roof of the ship also has an interesting feature in the form of a huge hatch that folds down if necessary to enjoy the open sky overhead. The power unit of the Mazu 82 features three Volvo Penta IPS diesel engines, capable of delivering 3,000 horsepower. The manufacturer tried to find a balance between the luxury of a luxury yachts and good maneuverability inherent in mid-size boats. The cruising speed of the 79-foot vessel is an impressive 40 knots. Roddles Reel Spinning is usually associated with a fairly large and oversized fishing device. However, founders of the Roddles Reels disagree with that. In their opinion, fishing can literally be done with a hook reel. The gadget they created features an all-metal construction that weighs only 0.16 pounds. It has got two holes for fingers that securely fix the device. The handle allows each to easily cast, guide the bait, and play the trophy. An unusual fishing rod is suitable for both hands, and the size of the device is perfect for carrying in the pocket. It takes a little skill and practice to master the innovative pocket spinning rod. Of course, it will be difficult to replace the professional Roddle's real equipment, but it can become an indispensable assistant during a tourist trip or in conditions of survival in an emergency. Neolix KFC While NASA is taking next steps on the way to new worlds, the KFC fast food chain decided to surprise with an unusual marketing trick. Autonomous food trucks appeared in China, allowing to purchase food at mobile service stations with no human contact. A user just needs to select the desired product on the screen and to make a payment via QR code. The food truck will automatically open the desired food compartment, allowing to pick up the order. The main feature of this device lies in its autonomous movement. A single battery charge is enough for 62 miles, which is more than enough for an unmanned retail outlet. The maximum speed is 31 miles per hour. It avoids obstacles and recognizes nearby objects without any problems. At the same time, the owner monitors the movement of the drones using GPS modules, 
and is constantly aware of their current location. Such an advanced basis for the KFC food trucks was created by the Chinese company Neolex. The drone manufacturer specializes in autonomous vehicles for courier delivery, advertising, and trade. Yar Droid Our next guest looks like a strange combination of a track tank and a modern robot. This is the Yar Droid, designed specifically for gardening. An autonomous gardener was developed by Whirly Max, which endowed it with an impressive functionality, as for such a tiny thing. An electronic assistant can treat weeds with herbicides, mow lawns, water plants, and perform other useful tasks. Moreover, Yard Droid charges itself and replenishes water supplies as soon as the need arises. The device moves on a track chassis, which makes it kind of similar to military drones. Interestingly, the garden tank has a real hunting mode, wherein looks for pests to eliminate them. At the front, it has got a movable tower that houses most of the tools including a camera suspension, a flashlight, and several nozzles for irrigation or soil treatment. Yardroid is capable of watering plants from a distance of 32 feet. Boeing 929 Jetfoil Not only modern projects can amaze with their capabilities and characteristics. For example, back in 1974, well-known Boeing launched a famous type of civilian ship called a jetfoil. These ships travel on fully submerged hydrofoils and are propelled by water cannons. Over the entire history of this project, more than 20 ships have been built. It should be understood that jetfoil are not simple cabin cruisers. Those are large seaworthy ships. Their capacity varies between 167 and 400 passengers depending on the modification. The design developed by Boeing was so successful that these vessels are still used as high-speed sea ferries in Japan, France, Great Britain, and other countries. Interestingly, the civilian project Jetfoil took as the basis the technologies used on the Tucumcari and Pegasus warships with hydrofoils. Colibri Perhaps the most beautiful minicar of this release is the brainchild of German engineers at Innovative Mobility Automobile. The compact single-seater electric car, which received the sonorous name of Colibri, once made a lot of noise at the Geneva Motor Show. Weighing 970 pounds and having a body length of 108 inches, this unit is capable of accelerating to 62 miles per hour in 10 seconds. On one charge, the mini car travels up to 68 miles, while you can charge the battery by 80% in just 20 minutes. The doors of the electric Colibri attract particular attention because they are made in the legendary form factor of gold wings. Typically, such solutions are used on premium vehicles such as a charged Mercedes-Benz and Tesla Model X electric crossover. The company representatives noted that they wanted to create not just a compact single-seat vehicle, but a product that will delight their customers. Opel Rack E The concept car of the well-known manufacturer Opel made a splash with its look at car shows. The tandem electric car resembles a futuristic, closed-type cart with a folding top. The concept is named after the experimental Rack 2 car with two rocket engines. It was on it that Fritz von Opel in 1928 developed an unprecedented speed of 141 miles per hour. The modern Rack E does not have the destructive speed characteristics, but it offers the driver good acceleration dynamics thanks to the 37 kilowatt electric drive. A power reserve is just under 62 miles. A battery capacity is 5 kilowatts. Special attention should be paid to the design of the car. An aggressive look is complemented by a cabin reminiscent of a fighter cockpit. A driver and a passenger are positioned one behind the other, as in the fighter. The rear fenders are shaped like shark fins and also emphasize the sports design of the car. LSEV 3D an idea of using a 3D printer in the automotive industry is not new. Some companies have long been using them to create parts for their cars. However, what about getting an entire production compact car printed? This is how the LSEV 3D electric car manufactured by XEV was conceived. Almost all parts of the vehicle are printed by a special printer. The only exceptions are glass, seats, and the power unit. Instead of 2,000 components required to assemble the interior and body of a standard LSEV class electric vehicle, the 3D version uses 57 printed parts. Production of one part takes from 2 to 10 hours. 
The use of such technologies allowed designers to endow the electric car with a recognizable look. In addition, the use of plastic reduced the car weight by 992 pounds. Almost half of the mass is accounted for by batteries, which enables overcoming up to 93 miles on a single charge. Multi-Tool EDC MS5 Imagine Harry Potter's magic wand in the survival world. This is approximately how engineers of the EDC MS5 survival kit startup position their development. It really looks like a small club with a lot of useful devices hidden inside. With such a compact size, a tool has all you need to survive. A flashlight, a GPS tracker, a water filter, a knife, and a military-grade compass. The kit also includes a magnesium flint to light a fire without any problems. The EDC MS5 survival kit is made of aluminum alloy or carbon fiber and is covered with high-quality leather on the outside. Of particular interest is the case for carrying the multi-tool. This is a 30-foot-long paracord that can be used in tandem with the MS5 if needed. In addition to the standard set of modules such as a flashlight and a knife, there is a built-in storage for small items inside the capsule. Platypus Swordfish Now it's time to look into the depths of the sea and see a project called Platypus Swordfish. This is a cabin cruiser capable of traveling over or underwater. In this case, the main part of the boat remains on the surface, and a capsule with people located in the center of the vessel descends downward. Underwater descent is provided by hydraulic levers. The first model of this boat was released in 2019. The central capsule was open, which is why the dive had to be carried out in diving equipment. The swordfish doesn't have such issues, since it has got a sealed compartment for passengers. Air will be supplied from the surface, and the body itself has got a sandwich structure with a wooden core. Interestingly, the updated platypus is fully electric. A top speed of 40 knots and a cruising range of 115 nautical miles on a single charge should be enough for a fun ride. Box Lock Each year, thousands of Americans face the so-called stolen package problem. Thieves are always ready to appropriate someone else's property left unattended. Smart Box Lock, as conceived by its creator, will easily protect you from them. The device is hung on a container or niche that serves as storage. The courier arriving at your house scans the parcel barcode and the lock opens automatically. After that, the delivery man leaves the purchase and the gadget is blocked until you appear. The device communicates with the owner's mobile phone reporting when someone tries to open the lock. You can also remotely unlock the box lock if you want someone else to pick up the package. The device is powered by a lithium-ion battery and is charged using the USB cable. The case is made of alloy steel, suggesting durability and high resistance to burglary. Duaxel NASA Exploring other planets is not easy. An experience of the curiosity and opportunity clearly demonstrated that NASA needs to think about developing alternative types of rovers. One of the striking examples of a new generation of rovers is the Duaxel project. We are talking about creating of a research transformer consisting of two highly mobile drones. Since the relatively low passability of mobile devices is a serious obstacle to the study of Mars, the engineers decided to use a modular rover layout. As a result, Duaxel is able to send out the front of its chassis for terrain reconnaissance. This occurs when approaching a difficult area such as the edge of a crater or a surface strewn with stones. The rover is divided into two parts connected by a cable. The feed of the device tightly fixes its position, after which two front wheels are sent to explore the terrain. The rover automatically sets the optimal route and possesses soil analysis tools installed in its rims. Experimental development is currently being tested in the Mojave Desert demonstrating its all-terrain capabilities and mapping skills to explore other worlds. Bionic Concepts In PC games and movies, the use of futuristic armor based on incredible technology is common. But what about real life? Is there biomechanical armor that looks like a secret Pentagon design? Yes, and Canadian engineers from Bionic Concepts create it. The prototype of the special armor for the spine is one of the latest products by the company. It consists of all-metal vertebrae made from a heavy-duty aluminum alloy. The upper part features a rigid collar fixed over the shoulders, 
Gas mask tubes are also attached here, and if necessary, can be connected to the armor. A long tail extends from the upper part of the vertebrae, exactly repeating the shape of the back. It is worth noting that this project is more of an experimental and entertaining prototype than a real armor. Phone Toaster Nowadays, you won't surprise anyone with an ordinary toaster. And what about a similar device for your phone? Imagine a toaster with your smartphone popping out instead of a well-done piece of bread. Not even kidding, because this device is called Phone Toaster. Instead of making delicious toasts, it actually performs a completely different task, disinfecting the surface of a mobile phone. Nowadays, the problem of personal hygiene and constant contact with contaminated surfaces has reached a certain climax. Phone Toaster completely disinfects your gadget in five minutes. Cleaning the smartphone from potentially dangerous microorganisms and bacteria is carried out using UV radiation. Moreover, such lamps are completely safe for a mobile device. Among other things, the toaster can be used as a speaker and has a built-in wireless phone charger. Flexagon All of us once came across square and not particularly convenient surge protectors that cause a lot of inconvenience in the process of using them. Flexagon believes that all this hassle can be eliminated by making protectors more flexible and mobile. An adjustable power strip has got four outlets and a cage with USB connectors that swivel relative to each other in all directions. As a result, an owner gets an electric snake, which takes any convenient shape. Like any modern surge protector, Flexagon ensures surge protection and grounded sockets. Lexus Hoverboard Many of you watched the famous Back to the Future 2, where Marty McFly flew on a hoverboard. Since then, enthusiasts have repeatedly tried to create an analog of the cinematic levitating board. There are several interesting projects. However, the one closest to the original idea was a board created by the engineers of the Japanese company Lexus. Even the look of the hoverboard is delightful. It has got some steam constantly coming out which is generated by a cooling system that runs on liquid nitrogen. The upper part of the gadget is made of premium bamboo. To fly on a Lexus board, you need a magnetic coating which was installed in the hover park in Barcelona. The canvas generates a special field that interacts with the superconductors installed in the experimental device. For thermoregulation and maintaining the temperature at negative 197 degrees, cryo chambers filled with liquid nitrogen are used. This allows the hoverboard to float above the magnetic cover and to safely support the weight of an adult. Model T For a long time, the field of robotics was limited to the entertainment and industrial sectors. Nevertheless, companies have been actively working to create robotic assistance for the service industry. Developed by Telexistence Corporation, Model T was one of the first systems to be integrated into retail. This semi-autonomous robot has got a remote control system. An operator controls the assistant using a standard set of virtual reality. The design of the robot features a movable platform with a humanoid torso fixed on it. It has got 22 mobile connectors, which enables performing a wider range of operations. The developer promises that the motion synchronization will have a delay of no more than 50 milliseconds. A person can connect to the Model T from anywhere in the world and work remotely without leaving their home. In the near future, the company plans to install robots in 20 retail stores.